Beybladers! Welcome to the Beyblade Burst official channel and to episode 3 of the On The Rise series. We've got a jam-packed episode, so buckle in and get ready to see some awesome new products. Once again, I'm Steven and this is Brendan. We're the Beyblade Geeks and we're going to be your hosts for this series. Like Brendan said, we've got some awesome new products to show you guys this episode. But that goes for every other episode in this series, so make sure you subscribe to this channel. We'll keep you bladers up to date by showing you the latest releases from Hasbro. You'll get to see how each product performs as well because we'll be testing them thoroughly through intense battles. Every Hasbro top has its own unique traits and abilities. The same goes for the base stadiums and the accessories that you use in battle. We'll make sure to tell you about them in our product reviews so you can stay ahead of the game. Those unique traits and abilities of the Hasbro products also carry over into the digital world of the Beyblade Burst app. So we'll show you what they can do within the app from time to time. Oh yeah, and if you're looking for the latest announcements on events or anything Beyblade Burst related, you will hear it here. Every episode will share exciting news, so make sure you stay tuned. To top it all off, you'll get to see some of the characters from the Beyblade Burst Rise animated series. The animated series is action-packed with unbelievable battles, and you'll get to enjoy them with us, as we'll occasionally preview some of the most epic matchups. On that note, let's introduce you to a very rebellious blader that you would never want to make enemies with. This is Arthur Peregrine, one of Dante's biggest adversaries in Beyblade Burst Rise. Like I just mentioned, Arthur is a very rebellious blader. He doesn't believe in the official league or how it runs the world of Beyblade. With his unrivaled strength, Arthur proclaims to be the true king of Beyblade. To really rule over other bladers as a king, Arthur wants to end the league and begin a new blading age built on power. He stated that the weak have no rights to blade. Such a savage statement to make, hey? Arthur is only concerned about his goal of ruling over the blading world, and with that, he only takes interest in other bladers that are powerful. Arthur is a true rebel. He'll battle whenever and wherever he desires. He doesn't care about the standard rules of Beyblade, and is solely focused on dominating his opponent through sheer strength. He actually barges in on a decisive battle between Iger and Delta during the intense Battle Island circuit, and completely interrupts it by joining in on the battle unannounced. Not only did they interrupt their battle, but Arthur and Prime Apocalypse completely annihilated the stadium that everyone was battling in. Check out the stadium! The entire playing surface is fractured, cracked, and just all kinds of messed up. Prime Apocalypse is definitely a force to be reckoned with. It features a never-before-seen burst prevention system. Like the name suggests, this system makes Prime Apocalypse virtually unburstable. There are some bays that have some really unique abilities that seem extremely overpowered but Prime Apocalypse definitely takes the cake. A bay that can't be burst goes against all Beyblade Burst logic. Pair that out with Prime Apocalypse's ability to enter Dark Flux, and there's not going to be many bladers willing to stand in Arthur's way. So that's Arthur Peregrine and Prime Apocalypse. That's a duel that you don't want to mess with. Being able to destroy a whole bay stadium is just so intense. With that, let's fulfill our promise to you bladers and show you this sick new product. This is the Vortex Climb Battle Set. This battle set comes with an all new base stadium that will bring your battles to a whole new level. You also get two hypersphere tops and two launchers. Let's start off with these hypersphere tops. This is Golden Judgment Dragon D5, a balance type. Take a look at some of these luxurious looking parts. They're all gold. This is a great top that you can add to your collection to really spice up the overall look. It just looks so fancy. Golden Judgment Dragon D5 looks so perfect that I almost don't want to battle with it. I wouldn't want to damage that beautiful gold design. This is a right spinning hypersphere top and the combination starts with the Golden Judgment Dragon D5 GT chip and energy layer base. The rest of the combo follows up with a D16 forge disc and a gold TH11 performance tip. Since this combination is in fact a balance type, Golden Judgment Dragon D5 has well rounded performance with a rating of 3 in both runtime and drop in frequency. The next hypersphere top that we have here is Prime Apocalypse A5 in attack type. The combo begins with the Prime Apocalypse A5 GT chip and energy layer base. Take a look at that sword like point on the energy layer. This particular edge sticks out further than other areas of the energy layer, which is going to be vital to Prime Apocalypse A5's attack power. Your opponent is going to suffer a lot of damage if they get hit full force with that blade. The rest of the combo consists of the D44 Forge Disc and the TH24 Performance Tip. As an attack type, Prime Apocalypse A5 is going to be dropping in for those attacks all the time. It has a rating of 1 in runtime and 5 in drop in frequency. Now, let's get to our favorite part about this battle set. This is the Vortex Climb Base Stadium, and even this can be customized to your liking. 
The Vortex Climb Base Stadium introduces some new areas for your Hyper Street Tops to battle in. In addition to the traditional battle ring, we have the brand new ramp, an optional brake plane, and battle access features. Before we show you the optional features, take a look at these massive ramps on each side of the base stadium. They slope upwards, allowing your hypersphere tops to travel up the ramp to perform a next level attack. Your hypersphere top can pull off an epic aerial move if it can maneuver up the ramp quickly. When you're ready to elevate the action in your battles, insert the optional green attachment. This part can be secured onto the main base stadium and adds even more fun to your battles. Once this piece is securely attached to your base stadium, you'll have access to the brink plane and battle axis. Your hypersphere tops will now be able to climb up the brink plane and drop back into the battle ring for an attack. In addition to that, the ramps will now flow seamlessly into the battle axis area. Utilize the battle axis to accelerate your hypersphere top spin and go in for a supercharged attack. What do you players think of all these pieces that came with this battle set? Sick, right? Before we battle out with the Vortex Slime battle set, let's take a look at all these products inside the Hasbro Beyblade Burst app. Welcome to the Hasbro Beyblade Burst app. Let's scan in these new products into the game. So we tap on Scan, Prime Apocalypse, A5. So next up, we also have the Golden Judgment Dragon D5. Let's do it up. Sweet. And don't forget about your base stadium, the Vortex Climb base stadium. Let's do it. Sweet. Uh, so let's customize the bay a little bit here. Let's put on the performance tip from Judgment Dragon D5. Let's save that up. Oh snap, look at that damage. And you know who it is. It's Prime Lockups A5. We're gonna take this win. Ooh, just look at that. Bam! A burst finish! Well, that's a pretty sick combo. So now that we've done a test battle in the Hasbro Baby Burst app, let's do some actual physical battles. Let's take this Vortex Climb battle set for a test spin, now that you've seen what you can do with it within the Beyblade Burst app. Time for some epic battles. Alright, starting off in the Vortex Climb Stadium without the green insert. 3, 2, 1, let's rip! Oh, sick burst! It's almost like a figure eight uh, movements there. Three, Three two, one. Three. Oh, you see that? Oh. oh, that was epic. Yeah, Golden Judgment Dragon D5 went up this ramp here and just absolutely flew. That was crazy. Three, Three two, two, one. Three. Wow, that was like one attack and Prime Apocalypse A5 bursted. Three, two, two one. Three. Oh, awesome. Ring out finish. Three, two, one. Another wow, burst finish. Double burst. Three, two, one. Wow, so calm all of a sudden. Calm before the storm. Oh, what? No way. Did not see that coming. Golden Judgment Dragon D5 took a burst finish, win. All right, so now let's incorporate the green insert. So now we will have a battle axis and brink plane to play with. Three, two, one, let's rip. Whoa! Did you see that crazy jump over there in that corner? That was insane. Look how fast that thing was. Three, two, one, let's rip. Oh, wow. Man, I love this battle set. The new base stadium is so much fun to battle in. I 100% agree. The Vortex Climb base stadium is my favorite piece in this battle set. Like Steven mentioned earlier, we'll bring you the latest Beyblade Burst news and announcements every episode. So let's go ahead and tell you about what we have going on. There's an exciting digital Beyblade event in the works coming. So keep checking our channel and Beyblade's official channels for more updates. We're excited to share what we have planned. 
Beyblade Burst will be releasing an album this September. It will feature the theme songs from seasons 1 and 2, along with one completely unreleased track, Journey Into Tomorrow. You can pre-save the first two tracks right now on Spotify. Keep checking out Beyblade's official accounts for more information. Check out these sweatshirts we're wearing! Looks pretty slick, hey? So they're now available on the Beyblade Amazon store. There's a wide variety of designs out there, so grab one and add it to your wardrobe. If you're a fan of Beyblade Generation 1, make sure you check out the Beyblade Amazon page as well. There's teas and other merchandise that you guys can check out. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of the On The Rise series. Tune in regularly so you don't miss out on the newest episodes of Beyblade Burst Rise and the latest product reviews. Make sure you subscribe to this Beyblade Burst official channel and check out the associated social media pages. See, See you later.